Hey YouTube, it's Peanut Rocking YouTube today with my first ever Christ Christmas wish list where well, I can't speak today. Um, I've been making a lot of videos. I don't have any pictures, I'm sorry, like of what I want. There's a I know I'm not gonna get all this, but there's so many electronics because my parents every year always get us at least one big thing. Last year is my computer, and this year I'm hoping to get a laptop. So I, yeah, cause I'm in high school, like I'm a sophomore, and you can bring computers to school. So yeah, to start off, I really want a TV for my room. I want a 26 inch or bigger HD TV, which I believe I'm gonna get along with an Xbox 360, which I'm very happy about. The TV doesn't have to be a big brand or anything to be any 26 inch or bigger HD TV. Next thing on my list. I already said, an Xbox 360. I do not have one at the moment, but I have a Wii, which I'm happy with. I used to have a PlayStation 2 and stuff, but it got old, so I sold it and got 70 bucks for it, so, along with the PSP, so yeah. Next one, look, I want a tablet, so here's some I want. The iPad 2, obviously, but I don't think I'm going to get it because it's really expensive, and I don't really want my parents spending, like, six hundred dollars on a tablet so yeah that's just an idea the next is the kindle fire because I, wa I want a kindle and a tablet and it's only like two hundred dollars so yeah I, I will probably get that the tv xbox and a couple games maybe a laptop i don't know so next thing on my list is well here's all the tablets i want barnes and noble nook tablet <laughs> i've never heard of it but it's about the same price a little bit more in the Kindle Fire, and I either wanted a Nook or Kindle, so yeah, decided to put that on the list too. Next one, it's a really expensive one, so I highly doubt I'll get it. It's the Samsung Galaxy Tablet, 10.1 inch, 8 gigabyte. I think they make 8 gigabyte, but just put that on there because a 16 gigabyte, which is the next one, is way too much. It's like same price as an iPad. I'd rather just have an iPad than that tablet. I also want, uh, like Motorola Zoom Family Edition tablet, 16 gigabyte, it's like 400 something dollars, which isn't that bad for a tablet, it's like a bit cheaper than the iPad. Again, I'd rather have the Kindle or Barnes and Noble. And that's it for the tablets. And Next up on my list is the Samsung 3 inch diagonal LCD 10 megapixel, 16 megapixel, 5 times optical zoom digital camera. It's the one with the screen on it. It looks really nice. Like, it has the screen right next to the shutter. And you can, like, if you're taking a picture this way and, like, the shutter is, like, facing you, you can see what you're taking a picture of. The other camera that I'd like, I want both, is the Samsung 16 megapixel 5 times zoom with 3.3 3 inch flip out touchscreen and a 4 gigabyte SD memory card. It's a camera and it looks really awesome. Like it has a screen, like this is the camera. So I'll get my, one second, I'll get the camera. I need to find the charger for it, that's why I'm not using that at all. I have the Nikon Coolpix S600, S3000, I bought it with my own money last year after my confirmation. This was an expensive camera, I'll tell you that right now, but it was worth it, it takes awesome pictures. And that's 12 megapixels, so I can't imagine what 16 is. Next up on my list is the Apple iPod Touch with generation 8 gigabyte. I don't listen to that much music, but I'd love to play the games on it. It's the white it's the white version. It looks really nice and yeah, so I decided why not throw that on the list. Next up oh yeah, I also want a laptop that's later on my list by accident. Next up are the video games and PC games I want. First one on my list is Sims 3 for the computer. I've had it. And I've lost it. And I've always want and I've I really love Sims. So I decided to get it. I decided I want it. I mean, 
Next up is modern. The rest of these are Xbox 360 games. If I get the Xbox, um, the reason I don't want a PS3 is because I have a Blu-ray player, and that's all. That's the only reason that I really wanted it. My parents are giving me their old one because they got the 3D one for the 3D TV downstairs. So yeah, first up is on my list is Modern Warfare 3. It looks like an awesome game, and it just came out. I got the like. I could have chosen either the 3DS, which is charging now, a couple weeks ago, or the Xbox 360, because they're like the same price nearly. But I chose the 3DS and get the Xbox for Christmas. But my my sister got the iPhone for us, which if I knew she, I could have got that instead of the. 3DS, I would have got that personally because but I'm pretty happy with my phone. Full touch screen, 42 gigabyte memory. So, yeah, why not? Um, next up on my list is Call of Duty Black Ops. I've played these games before, like Call of Duty games and Modern Warfare games on my cousin's Xbox, and they are awesome. I fell in love with them as soon as I started playing with it. I'm terrible at them, but yeah. They're pretty good games, I think. Like, please don't. Like, if anybody watches this, I highlight out somebody that many people will. But don't comment saying that I'm, that I'm not going to get all of this. I know I'm not going to get all of this. The electronics, like, like I said, we usually only get like one or two electronics. And those are just ideas of what my, so my parents know what I want. Like, I don't want my parents to buy me all of them. What would I do with like five tablets and yeah, what am I gonna do with five tablets and three cameras? So next up on my list is Gears of War three. I saw the commercial. My friend has it. And I've heard it's a really good game and the commercial for it looked awesome. I'd love to get the Gears of War three exclusive Xbox three sixty. That would be awesome because it comes with the game. But it's like $100 more. I'd rather just have my parents pay the 60 bucks to get the game. Next up on the list is The Elder Scrolls 5. No, 4. Skyrim. No, 5. Yeah, 5. It looks like an awesome game. My friend recommended it, it to me. The, that the Elder Scrolls are a really good series of games. So I decided to tr I'll try it if I get the Xbox. So next up is... Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Another game recommended by my friend, uh, my best friend's in second grade and I'm a sophomore in high school. So yeah, I thought, why not try it? I trust her. Sort of. Next up on my list is Madden NFL 12. I know I'm a girl. I like football. I can throw a perfect spiral. In me football, I'll throw a spiral. I'll videotape it if you don't believe me. I'll make a video of it, just let me know if you want me to. Obviously, when I get my new camera and when it's nicer out, well, nice, but, like, today, it's, like, 60 degrees and it's nearly December. So, yeah. I found it really awesome, though. Next up on the list is Battlefield 3. Just a random game I threw on there that I thought looked pretty cool. It's War, so... The war game seemed fun enough, so I decided to put that on the list. Like, that's one of those games I don't really care if I get. Like, Halo 3. Just, Halo 3 was a cheap game on GameStop.com. So I threw that on there, so that way I have a game that's not too much money. So hopefully I'll get it. So it's like 8 bucks. Next up, Medal of Honor. Another war game. That seemed decent enough. Like, it looked decent. It looked like a good game. So yeah. Next up is Assassin's Creed Revolution Revelations. I haven't heard much about this game, I'm gonna be honest. But yeah. Assassin's Creed. My friend recommended all the games, so yeah, my friend's also a girl and she likes blood and gory stuff, which is very surprising because she won't watch horror movies. Yeah. Next up is Portal 2. The Portal games always looked awesome. So, I decided to throw that on there. Because the Portal games, like, 
How can they not look awesome? Seriously. Next up is... I wanted an Xbox 360 wireless controller, so I have two controllers. But if Xbox comes with two controllers, can someone just throw me a quick comment or message? Because I don't want my parents wasting money on a controller when I don't need three controllers. Next up is Halo Reach. That's a newer version of Halo, but and it looks really awesome. Look, all these games are pretty expensive. I don't expect to get all of them. I get, I expect to get maybe like three or four, maybe five. The top. Uh, next up is this is for the 3DS now. Zelda: Ocarina of Time. I've never played the Zelda games. They look like my all my friends say they're amazing. And so, why not? Next up, this comes out on the 4th Mario of December, Mario Kart 7. I have, Mar I, have I have Super Mario Land 3DS, and I'm obsessed with that game. I can't, like, I, like, literally can't put it down, but I have to for this video. It is, like, 40 bucks, and it is so worth it. Next up is Pokemon Rumble Blast. Don't make fun of me, because I like Pokemon, and I'm 15, Big Whoop. So yeah, I don't know if I really want that game. I'm kind of getting sick of Pokemon. The original, like, I collect Pokemon cards, but I like the original Pokemon, or like, and Hoenn Pokemon, some Diamond and Pearl, and only the starters in black and white. I'm a Pokemon fan all the way for the original. Oh crud! Sorry, excuse it. I'm running out of time. Um, on to the other stuff I want. I want to, I would like, like, not want, a Visa gift card. Every year my parents usually get us a hundred or fifty dollar gift card for Visa so we can spend it anywhere we want. Um, a PetSmart gift card, because in case you haven't watched my other videos, I have five hamsters. Three went to right babies, I went to right mother, and a Russian dwarf. I bought the hamster, I bought the winter white pregnant unknowingly. So yeah, just letting you know right ahead of time, I did not breed the Russian in the winter, right? Next up is a game, is a Barnes and Noble gift card. I'm a big time reader. Like I have hundreds of books, literally. I love the Warrior series. I just I just finished the Forgotten Warrior the other day when it first came out. I I got it. I read it and I loved it. Next up is a GameStop gift card. I really like a GameStop gift card. Because if I get the Xbox 360, I'm going to want to buy more games. And I have a points plus card. And pro since I spent like $300 at GameStop on one day for the 3DS, I got the warranty and everything. I got I think I have mad points and I can get a lot of stuff. But I can't find my password or which email I use. So yeah. next up. Okay, who doesn't want money? Like, it's either money or a music gift card probably. And I prefer cash because that way I can literally spend it everywhere and Visa cards aren't accepted everywhere. Next up is I have two things left. A North Face jacket. I've always wanted a North Face jacket. I have Columbia, I have like two Columbia jackets. Like I'm not I'm not poor but I'm also not rich. Like my parents have a decent amount of money. We are pulling through. And they, I have a sister, and they spend literally like maybe fifteen hundred dollars on us every, like fifteen to two thousand dollars on us every Christmas, each. So that's a pretty big deal. You know, like my parents said they want to send us to Disney, but I feel bad because I don't want them going broke for it. Like I feel like if we go to Disney, they'll be broke, and I would feel really bad about that. Next, and the last thing is. Four Yankees tickets. I might want that for my birthday, my 16th birthday in March, or Christmas. I don't know yet. I like I found some pretty cheap ones for like nine rows from the field. They're like 100 and something dollars. Well, that's my Christmas wish list. Bye.